friends. Hi, hello, how are you? Welcome or welcome back to the Curvy Chronicles. My name is Courtney and I'm so glad you found your way to my little corner of the internet. Today we are doing our week three for November cash stuffing. Let's get into it. It's going to be a good one. Okay, friends, first and foremost, new nails. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but they are a dark green. And then my gem of a nail tech did these fun flowers with gold glitter. Love them. I'm in love. Anyway, also, the best thing about today is we are stuffing the most I have ever stuffed in a weekly cash stuffing. I am so, I'm just giddy. Um, Cody got his raise. So basically, they were negotiating for a higher per diem um, for the job they're working on, and he got it. So we are stuffing, I want to say it is like 900 and change today, which is the most we've ever stuffed. And part of that is because we are just going to even out some accounts, put some money where we want it. And then um, next week, because we weren't really expecting this, we weren't sure it would go through. So next week, we're going to try and dive into um, some more debt payoff. But let's count it. I'm so excited, you guys. I can't even tell you. When I saw the check roll through to budget, I was like, holy crap -oly. Um so Guys, I have not stuffed this much cash. I believe since our tax return last year. So like to say that I'm giddy is like an understatement. So let me move my wallet. We're going to jump into our, our online binder. So for anyone that's new, um, I do prop cash in this binder specifically for accounts that I just transfer money to online because we tend to spend from them with like online transfers and or um, credit card, like our debit card purchases and things like that. They also tend to carry higher balances. So in car maintenance day, Christmas is fully funded. We're leaving that alone. But car maintenance today is getting 170. So this is going to equal us out so that we have 500, which again, just makes me so giddy. So we have 100, 200, 300, 50, 450, 70, 90, and 500 in car maintenance, which is freaking amazing. Um, my goal, now that he's got the pay raise, my hopeful goal is that we can end the year with $1,000 in car maintenance. Um, even with paying extra to debt, I'm hoping that we can build this up because number one, I want to at least have a minimum 600 because that's what I know we need for all of our tabs and insurance. So if we have that before the start of the year, anything we put into it after the start of the year is just going to be extra. Um, but if we could have a thousand dollars in here, like I would literally just have a sigh of relief <laughs> would make me so happy. Um, a propane, our propane is going to be getting $100. I got to start beefing this up because we are in the midst of cold season. So it is going to be something where we're going to have to fill it a lot sooner. Probably, um, so far we've had pretty mild temperatures, but most likely January. So I want to make sure I can get up to, cause we're probably going to do a full fill, not just a half fill. If I can get a thousand dollars in here too, I'll be freaking smiling till the days are over. So I have 150, 250, 70, 90, and 300 in propane. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. And the thing I'm most excited for with this final $200 preschool for the entire 2023-2024 school year is fully funded. That's my sound effects because I don't want to put sound effects in my video. Anyway, I probably should. I should just do that instead of my voice. But we now have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 950, 1,000, 50, 100, 11, 50, 70, 90, 12, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 75, and 80. 1280. 
Um, now, mind you, we have already paid for September, October, November, and then the last month of school, which will be May, because in the beginning, we do have to pay for the last month. So this right here will cover everything else for the rest of the school year, and we do not have to put anything into preschool. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Come January, we are going to start um, a new challenge to save up what we need for next year's preschool, but because we have a longer time frame to do it, <laughs> we won't have to shovel as much as hard. So I'm really, I'm so excited for that. Like I'm really proud. I'm really proud of us and just, you know, we might not have put a lot to debt, but instead of making this a monthly bill, we were able to save up the money in the meantime. I just, I'm really proud of us. Um, and then Cody, Cody's hobbies, Cody's hobbies, um, are getting 50. So he has 150, 200. He doesn't really need anything. Hunting season is over. So we'll probably just let that sit. I'm probably still going to kind of build this up a little bit. Hopefully maybe use some of it towards his birthday trip next year, but that is our online binder. Okay. Now we're going to jump into our wallet, our wallet, take out my receipts. So I'm going to put my fetch code on there. Remember, if you use my fetch code, you do get some points. I get some points when you scan your first receipt. Make sure you scan your first receipt. Um, it's just like a little referral bonus for putting that in. And yeah, I love fetch. It's great for like saving for Christmas. Um, I will leave Andrew's channel link down below, but Ange Budget and Debt, she does this whole work your apps off for Christmas and does all these different apps and how you can save money to go towards like just money for Christmas. And she's killed it. Like I'm impressed. Color me shocked. Okay, guys, we have rollover. So this first one you're going to, you're going to be shocked by. <laughs> we have <laughs> 20 40, 50, 65, and 70 dollars in grocery. And you might be thinking, Courtney, you put 75 in there. You are correct. I did not have time to go grocery shopping. Um, nor did I feel like going grocery shopping. So we literally ate out of the house and I didn't spend any of my grocery money. So you know what that means? Um, <laughs> we're gonna put this all as rollover. Uh just kidding. We're gonna save 20 of it. So we're going to put 20 in two, and then we are going to put the rest to our rollover, which you know goes to our challenges. Um, we do have coffee rollover. Let's see how much we got in here. So we have five, six, seven, eight, and nine in there. I probably should just like, st oh, there it goes. Um, kids and pets don't have anything. And then we have eat out rollover, which I'm excited about too. So we have 10, 11, 12, 13. So total rollover for this week, which is just insane, is 20, 40, 50, 60, 75, 85, 86, 7, 8, 9, 90, 1, and 92. But we are going to take 20 and put that into our grocery money. Um, so with Thanksgiving coming up this week, we are not stuffing very much for groceries because we are not going to be eating a whole lot. I mean, we have a couple of days, obviously, before Thanksgiving, but really not a whole lot we need. So groceries is literally just getting $30, but with our $20 rollover, we are going to have $50 towards groceries, which, um, as we can see, I really probably don't even need because we probably could eat out of the house for another week, but 30 or $50 for groceries. I do actually have to go and pick up some stuff because the kids need, um, toothpaste. Let's see coffee. I don't remember why I put this in here, but Oh, I have a meeting I have to go to. So, um, and it is, we're meeting at a coffee shop. So one, two, three, four, five. So we are putting $5 or $20 into coffee because I am purchasing. It is my treat. So we have $20 for coffee. I have a meeting tomorrow. I forgot about totally space that. So coffee kids, uh, Cody gets his $30. His goes in there. Pets is good. And then eating out. Um, so this one is getting, let's see here, 20, 30, 40, 5, and 50. Hold on. There was a ripped 5 in here. Let me find it. It was gnarly. There it is. We're going to put that in the eat out. Um, today, actually, after I'm done filming this, we are going to, I have to take the kids to go get... Claire's doctor's appointment. So we are going to be getting lunch while we're out um, because I'm literally going to pick her up from school and I kind of need to hurry to do this. But um, so 20, 30, 40, 5, 50. Um, we're getting lunch and then 
There's another thing we have to do, and I can't remember what it is. So I put money in here for that. I'd have to look at my calendar. I don't know. There's something else that's coming up. But wallet is done. I still have cash in my wallet that I need to deposit. Hello, tiny assistant. I went to the bank today and totally forgot to put money, deposit money, because I was talking. I shouldn't do that. Anywho, all right, so we're going to dive into my Soul Mama Rituals Cancer Binder. If you do need a new binder, you can um, hit them up. I have a link in the description. It is a, um, I do make a little little bit of money if you use my link. It's greatly appreciated. So, because we got an increase in this week's check, we're putting a little bit more money in each of these. Family Fun is getting $10 today. We did take some money out of here to buy butter braids for Claire's school fundraiser. So we bought two butter braids. It'll be fun. So we have 50, 65, 75, 85, and 90 in Family Fun. It's kind of nice to actually spend the money out of there, <laughs> considering that we um, really haven't in recent little whiles. And then um, clothing is getting 15, and this should give us an even... $100. So we have 50, 65, 75, 85, 95, 100, which is fabulous. Um, because I plan on using this to purchase socks and underwear that are half off at Fred Meyers on Black Friday. Um, we did use our date night money. We went out to dinner and um, got ice cream. Oh my goodness. It was so fun. We had a great time. Um, we ended up eating early enough that we got happy hours. So all of our drinks were half off, which was amazing so we um did leave a really good tip because we had a great waitress so we spent a hundred of our date night date night money so we're putting 10 in so that's going to give us 10 20 35 45 55 and 60 dollars so we'll build this up again um our next date night is already planned but it is cody's christmas party so we don't have to pay for booze or food <laughs> it's amazing pets pets is getting its usual 30 um, but I, so when I went this last time to get dog food, they had a, like a thing where I got a $10 gift card, um, for if I bought that certain brand of dog food, which happens to be the one we were buying. So basically I got a $10 gift card. So we have 20, 30, 40, and $50 technically in pets because the next time when I go buy pet food or chicken food, we're going to use that gift card. Um, chickens, what are chickens getting? Chickens are getting 15 I told you, we went we went a little hog wild and crazy over here. So chickens now have 50, 70, 80, 95, and 100. I did have to pick up new heat lamps that they actually enjoy because the other ones they did not like. I had to get the ones with the, like, infrared. Yeah, they're, they're not happy with me. Them birds are not happy with me. Garden is also getting 15, which makes me so excited. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 75, and 80 dollars. Halfway to a green stock, guys. Halfway again. Let's not, we're not gonna spend anything out of here so I can get what I want. Um, gifts, we did keep this one light and simple because I really don't have anything. I do have my niece's birthday coming up, but it um she's one, so we are gonna spend like 20 bucks max. So we have 10, 15, 25, and 30 dollars in there, and we'll just slow and steady. Slow and steady wins the race on that one. Um, again, anniversary is the same. It's also getting five. This one, again, is just slow and steady wins the race. So we have 20, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85. Is that right? 85. Yes, it is. Um, trust me, I know we need a bill condensing. I do know this. Um, end of the world. Getting our last little dollar. That's going to put this at 40, I believe. So we have 10, 15, 25, 26, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 40. Um, I have a bill condensing planned, but not for like two more weeks. So we'll see how far we can push it. <laughs> All right, jumping into this one. Oh, I'm excited. Okay, so nails. Nails is getting. 25, um, which I think I put a picture in my last cash stuffing of Claire and I getting our nails done. We had so much fun. Um, she loved it. She had so much fun. She picked out her two colors. Like she sat still and she like hung out while I got my nails done, which for a four year old to sit for probably like two hours, I think it was, she did amazing. She brought stuff the color and then she ended up watching a show on my phone too. So nails after 25 has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, and 125. 
So my next nail appointment is um, the day of Cody's Christmas party. I go that morning and get my nails done. And then, guys, we had hair rollover. So we got our hairs did. Um, I ended up having $50 left. So I just took it back in my hair envelope instead of putting it into challenges because um, I did pre-schedule my next appointment for March. And this will give me less I have to save. So that was my, my thought on that. But we're going to go back to massage. And massage is going to get $25 because, so I do have the gift certificate, but I want to make sure I have like enough to tip and all that. So I have 20, 40, 65, 75. Um, I did book the, the appointment. I'm so excited. I go the same day as Cody's Christmas party because it's at the same hotel. And I am just, I'm so pumped. And then if I have anything extra left over, I'm going to um, see if they'll let me get, like, they have, like, a, they do a whole spa thing. But I want to see if I can get a pedicure while I'm there, too. I did not book it ahead of time. So we'll see if that works out. If it doesn't, I'm not even worried about it. Because it's already a pamper me day. And I'm already so excited. And I don't have to buy dinner. And I don't have to buy drinks. So that's even better. All right. Holiday binder. This one, we did not do anything crazy. Yeah. Kept it the same. $50 into the whole binder, so $10 into Valentine's Day. So we are at 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 5, 95, 100, 5, and 10. 110 in here. Um, I think my goal in this one is 150 so that if Cody and I want to go to dinner, we can, and then we can do some simple stuff. With this $10, Easter is going to be fully funded. So we have 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 75, 85, 95, 100. We're capping Easter at 100 because I spent $75 last year on baskets and eggs and candy and all the crap. Still had some left over. And to be honest with you, it was way too much. So $100 is all I get for clothes, like an Easter outfit for the kids, and then all the stuff. Now, as they get older, we probably will put more in here. But for right now, $100 is enough. Um, then we go into spring. Whoops, I don't need that. But spring's getting five. So we have 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 50, and 55. Um, truthfully, we don't have any spring plans, but like now that Claire's in school, we have a spring break, so we might do something fun there. Nothing crazy, but just something fun. Mother's Day is getting five, so we have a 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 70. 70 Mother's Day, which means we are almost halfway to the goal because each of these is a $150 goal as well. Oh, yeah. Father's Day, same five. So it's 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 70. Booyah. Booyah. All right. Summertime is also getting five. And it is at 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 55 in summer. And our last one. No, we have two more. Um, Fourth of July is getting five. You guys know we get the we do all the fives, all the fives. So we have 20, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 80. 80 in there. And then the fair is getting five. So we have five, 10, 15, 25, 35, 40 in the fair. Okay, why do I have an extra five? Hold on. I shouldn't have an extra five. Why do I have an extra five? Where did I? Oh, I know where I messed up. Okay. So holidays done. We forgot. I forgot. We didn't put just a dollar in end of the world. We put $6. So that's going to put us at 45. I'm not going to recount it because there's too many ones in there. Yes, I know. Cash condensing's on the way. So the next thing up is we have 20, 40, 60, 80, $100 to go into challenges and I'm not doing it just as 20s what I'm gonna do real quick like because truth be told you will be seeing this the saving challenge Sunday video that's gonna go up before you see this cash dumping I am going to exchange a hundred of this for that we're gonna take a five and two ones and then we're going to stick that there and then we are going to put this with the rest of our savings challenge money because then <laughs> 107 and that goes in our this is our christmas in july so this is our extra spending money for black friday and then i have more money because i did cash in my coin jars which you guys will know because you'll see that video before this so um we're adding in a hundred dollars of fives 
and ones. <clears throat> and then we're going to add in this and that means we're going to have a very healthy cash stuffing because I finally got my schedule figured out. So look at that. Savings Challenge Sunday. You would have already seen this though. So anyway, we are done as you see. Sir, we are done. That concludes today's cash stuffing. Someone would like to go somewhere. I don't know where he thinks we're going. We're going to go pick up his sister. That's all we're, we're going. Actually, we have to go to the doctor's appointment too. So anyway before he continues on i'm gonna close this one out i hope you guys enjoyed today's video please give it a thumbs up if you did make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can hang out with us for all the future shenanigans i am writing out my december schedule and i actually have quite a bit of fun planned um plus we're gonna be doing some major moves now that cody's got that raise going in there and we have a magic month for november because cody gets paid weekly and um on thursdays typically and uh yeah we have a lots coming. So November's a magic month. And that's all she wrote. So I will see you guys in the next one. And until then, remember to spread kindness like glitter. Bye, guys.